Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs. Hi, everybody. Can you guess who I am? Yep, Snow White. I live in this royal palace. And I live with my father and my stepmother. But my stepmother isn't very nice. I'll try to be happy. Oh, Snow White! There you are! I have been looking everywhere! Oh, you know, it must be so hard for you to live with such a gorgeous woman such as I. I like it when you're pretty. You do? But how? How could you ever possibly like living with such a gorgeous creature such as myself? Uh, I don't mind. Well, just to let you know that I'm not tricking you or anything. Behind this royal curtain, there is a royal mirror. Mm -hmm. And I've never shown this to anyone before. Wow. That is very pretty. It is, isn't it? Yes. It is. So every morning and every night, I look into this mirror. And I say, mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? Oh, that's so cool. It's a magic mirror. Hello there, Queenie. Hello there, mirror. So, you asked me who the fairest in the land is? Yes. Well, you are very fair, Queen, and you were the fairest. What's that supposed to mean? Snow White is now the fairest in the land. What? That's a nice mirror. Oh, but how could you say such a thing? Oh, that is just so, oh, I don't even know what to say. Snow White, please, will you please leave me? Queen, um, pretty things and beautiful things aren't the most important things in the world. What is important? And is being nice and being kind. Yes, but it's not the same. I mean, people can see your beauty and everything, but when you're kind, then uh, it's just not the same. Please, please leave. Okay, I'll leave, but try to be happy, stepmother. to first close this so they won't see it. Perfect. Gerson, please enter. I have to talk to you. My queen, I am at your service. Oh, finally. Whatever took you so long? Oh, it, it doesn't matter. I would like you to go and fetch me the royal huntsman. And quickly. I will, my queen. My queen, your royal huntsman is here. Thank you. Now please, guard the doors so no one will come. I would like to talk to the huntsman alone. Come close. I have a job for you to do. Snow White has been bothering me for too long. And I need you to take her into the woods on the other side of the kingdom and get rid of her for good. Do you understand? I will do as you command. Good. Now I have some royal stash here. I will give you some now. I will give you five at the moment. When the job is done, I will give you 20. But the job must be done, or else no money. Be gone. Ow! <laughs> oh, my plan is working. I will finally be rid of her. <laughs> my evil 
the other one. The huntsman who hurt me. I'm so glad he let me go. I've been walking through these woods for hours. I'm tired. I hope I find a place to sleep. Oh look, there's a pretty little cottage. I wonder who was there. I think I'll go and see. Ah, <sighs> at last. I just barely saw the huntsman coming back from his journey with the task that I gave him. So that means that the mirror can finally tell me that I am the most beautiful. Oh. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? Oh, um, I'm sorry. I'll have to call you back. Yeah, it's the queen again. All right. Yeah, bye. Hello, queen. As I was saying, mirror, mirror on the wall, who is the fairest of them all? I told you just a while ago, it's Snow White. But the huntsman took her out and did away with her. That's impossible. Well, she's in the other side of the kingdom in a little cottage. Well, oh, then I will have to have a little bit of a word with that huntsman. Yes, sir! Oh. My queen, I am at your service. Go and fetch me the royal huntsman again. I will. I will go fetch him. My queen, your royal huntsman is here. Thank you. Now guard the door and close the doors. Royal Huntsman, did you do the job that I asked you to do? Yes. Lies! All lies! She's so... <laughs> <laughs> I am sorry, my queen. I, Jesus, but she's on the far side of the, of the kingdom. You will never see her again. But that is not good enough! Not good enough, I say! Oh, get out of my sight! Leave! Is this me? I won't be getting paid. Yes! I'm one of the seven dwarves. I'm 
what's your name? Can you guess? You have some long hair and a long forehead. So it might be forehead. <laughs> um, sorry, my name is Baldy. Oh. Anyway, why do we have a girl in our house, Nosy? I don't know. She, she was here when I came in. When all your brothers are here, I'll tell you my story. Hey, get in here! What? The golden suit! Oh, what's your name? My name is Snow White. I already met Baldy and, and Nosy. So who is your name? Can you take a guess? Um, is it Mr. Big? Is it Mr. Tall? Nope, my name's Shorty. <laughs> Shorty is a funny name because you're so big. <laughs> yep, I am. That's why they call me Shorty, just for fun. <laughs> hey, here's another dwarf, everybody. Hi, everybody. I had a good day of hot dog. I'm so sleepy. We got a person in so new deal. Who is it? My name is Snow White. Move along, Sony. I'm gonna have a nice rest. So, what's your name? Can you go? Might be Sleepy. No. It's pretty close, though. Um, maybe it's Dreamy. Yep, that's me. Here, Dreamy, go sit over there. Sure. You can have a sleep. Nice dreams. Whoa! Are you okay? You better make, you have to take better care of yourself. Well, I have no time. Who are you? Um, I said my name is Snow White. Move over, shorty. <laughs> so what's your name? Can you guess? Um, it might be... Um, Bali. No, that's not my name. Okay. But it might be Clumsy. Yep, that's right. My name is Clumsy. The clumsiest dwarf of them all. Well, I'm home. You might want to plug your nose in the way. Um, uh, you do smell a little bit stinky. <laughs> hey, get out of here so he can talk to our new friend. Okay. You're a beautiful lady. What's your name? Uh, my name is Ellie. What's your name? Can you guess? It might be Smiley. Nope, that's not my name. But Pretty close. close. Um, is it Whiffy? Yep, that's me. I'm proud of it. Hey, Whiffy, go sit over somewhere else. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's rude. <laughs> hey, we got something special here. Who? Oh, it's a good. What's your name? My name is Snow White. What's your name? Well, there's seven of us dwarfs. The, you already met Nosy, Baldy, Shorty, Dreamy, Clumsy, Whiffy, and my name's Bob. <laughs> Bob is a funny name for a dwarf. <laughs> so this is how it began. My mother died and my father married the cat. Mother, and she was very not nice. She wanted to kill me. The huntsman let me go, then I ended up at your house. Well, you can have a place to sleep. And you can, and it, only if you do the dinner. And I wash will. the house. Keep it very clean. I will. Sounds good to me. Got you some breakfast, guys. Oh, jeez. Oh, that looks delicious. Oh, it smells good in here. Oh, yeah. 
So we got some hard work today. Where are you going to work this time? Well, we're going down the mine to find some gems. And metal. Oh, that sounds fun. Yeah. I'll stay here and I'll stay here and work on the house. Okay. Sounds good. Well, I'm off to work. Bye, See you Shorty. guys later. See you Bye. later, Snow White. Bye, Bob. It, it seems like Philip is gone too. Bye, Snow White. Hey, say bye to the others for me. Okay. Just have a clean the house. Finally, the final touch to my amazing peddler costume. She will never recognize me. Oh, I've got the bodice corset ready. Oh, I will pull it so tight that she will never be able to breathe. Oh, now, I will have to go and find that cottage that the husband told me about. Oh, I better change my voice or else she will know that's me. Hmm. Well, hello, young lady. No, that's, that sounds like a man. Um, well, hello, young lady. <laughs> Perfect, yes. Okay, got it. <laughs> Here we go. I just finished cleaning the house. I just have a little drink and I may have a little rest. Oh, there's somebody at the door. I better answer it. Oh, you look like a nice lady. Why, thank you very much. Would you like to come in and have a sit down? Oh, yes, please. Sit down right here. Oh, thank you. And what might your name be? Snow White, I am a peddler, and I go around selling different things. Oh. Now tell me, are you having any difficulty working around the house? Yes, I'm just in heavy things. Oh, well, you know what? I have got this corset, and it will do just the job to have your back feel better. Oh. Would you like to try it on? Oh, lovely. Sit right here, please. Turn around, please. Thank you. Uh, all right. Uh. Oh, you're too tight. I can hardly breathe. <laughs> oh, I tricked you. I am your stepmother. Ah. <laughs> now I will be the fairest in the land. <laughs> There's a strange corset thing on her. Is she dead? Maybe we should take it off. Maybe it plugged up her breathing system. I better do the chest compressions. Yep, we tried to kill her with this body. <gasps> we all have brothers. Nosy, Baldy, and Bob are outside chopping wood.
Her evil stepmother was here. She was dressed up like a pair lady, so I couldn't recognize her. She was with the bodice, and she tightened it really tight. I don't like that lady. Me either. <laughs> well, make sure you're careful who you let in the house. Yep. I'll see her face and see it face. But it's step. And I'll say, never come in, stepmother. I know it's you in a disguise. Well, if I see her, I'll give her a big hug and she'll be as stinky as me. <laughs> Gown feels so much better than that awful peddler suit that I wore, whatever. Oh, but now Snow White is finally out of my way and I'm the most beautiful out of them all. Oh, now the mirror has to tell me that. Magic mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? Oh. Hello? Oh, it wasn't me! Oh. Queen! Yes. As I was saying, magic mirror on the wall, who is the fairest of them all? I told you several times now, it's Snow White. But I went to the house myself and, you know, did a corset and made it way too tight for her. She no. has to be. No, gone. she is still alive. Oh, you're kidding me. Fine, I will make a better plan. But... Well, she will definitely fall for this plan. <sighs> well, I have got my comb ready with this poison, and this has got to work. And with this last piece, she will never be able to recognize me. <sighs> okay, here we go. Please work. You look like a nice lady. Well, thank you. Um, you, I probably shouldn't let you in because I'm the only one here. Oh, such a shame. Well, uh, it is very cold out here today. Um, come in. Oh, thank you so much. Would you like to sit down? Oh, thank you. Would you like some water? Oh. No, thank you. Hold just a moment. Oh, okay. I have been walking yes. around. Yes, you've been selling combs. How did you guess? And you're a peddler lady. How did you guess? <laughs> I just saw those clothes on. <laughs> oh, you must be a mind reader. Well, would you like to try it? Yes, my name is Snow White. Oh, hello, Snow White. Well, anyway, start up skirt. Thank you. Okay. Let's see. Let's come up right here. And, oh dear. Oh dear. I think it's stuck. <laughs> <laughs> you always fall for my tricks, Snow White. Pleh. For I am again your stepmother. <laughs> Today. 
Wow. Thank you for saving me. It was so nice for you. I think the comb must have been poisoned. Let's see if it is poisoned. Shorty, stick your tongue out. <laughs> yep, as I pointed to me. So it was poison. Yeah, I can't believe it. Well, that comb has made me feel too good. I'm sorry, Baldy. I should have listened to you. Well, just do it next time and we'll forgive you. How about we don't let any more peddler ladies into this house? Mm -hmm. Oh, I hear the other door is coming back. Oh, look! Not a hog day. Yep. It happened again. But this time, the evil witch used a comb. Yeah! And so she dressed up like another peddler lady. Dreamy, <gasps> <gasps> uh, you're very strange. That old witch. A comb? You can't hold someone with a comb. Unless it's poison. It definitely tastes like poison. What did you do this time? <laughs> Where are the other doors? They're out fixing the roof. It has a little leak in it. Oh, finally! Oh, back into my nice gown again. That peddler disguise was very itchy. It was horrible. Oh, but that poison comb was a very good idea. Oh, even better than my last one. Okay, mirror. Ah, oh. oh, tell me I'm beautiful. Magic mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? Oh, oh queen. Sorry, enjoying the beano. <laughs> <laughs> Was there something you wanted to ask me? Yes, mirror, mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? Oh, queen. How many times are you going to ask me? My answer is still Snow White. But I used a comb on her this time, and I was sure that was going to work. A comb? Yes, it was poisoned. Well, obviously it doesn't work. Fine. Oh, there is at least one good idea that I have left. I will use it. <laughs> this one will work. It will. I've got an apple in my hand. Doesn't it look so beautiful? So beautiful and red and normal? On this side, it is. But on the other side, it's poisoned. <laughs> this will definitely work. Yes! <laughs> well, I'm gonna have to work. Oh, clumsy! One day you day hurt yourself. It's okay, it happens to me all the time. I always fall over. Well, bye, Snow White. Bye, Clumsy. Whoo wee! I think I know who that is. It might be Wiffy. Wiffy, don't you ever take baths? Nope, I'm allergic to water. Just a little old lady has so many apples that I don't know what to do with them all. Um, I like apples. Oh, you do? Well, then may I come in? Yes. Oh, thank you. You would make you sit down. Yes, please. Thank you. Now, see here, I have this beautiful red apple. Um, um I've been. Oh my god, I'll be a poison again. Well, 
How about this? I will bite one half and you can bite the other half. Oh, okay. Mmm, see? Would you like a drink? Oh, yes, please. This is wonderful creation. A prince? Why are you now here? Well, the kingdom of Snickerstan is just over the border over there. And I thought I would just ride around in my horse through the woods. And I saw your beautiful cottage and thought I might get a drink. May I have one? Oh, you want a drink or come on in. Oh, sorry to interrupt your dinner. Oh, no, no, that's fine. Who's that? Oh, that's just Snow White. She's quite beautiful. Is she a princess? Yes, but she's, um, a little bit dead. Dead? And you're eating dinner around her? Well, she really is so pretty. She makes a good centerpiece to our table. Um, how did she die? Um, you see this apple here? She took that bite. And it was poisoned. And it stuck in her throat. And the witch took this bite and not sure how she didn't die. So she ate this and it was poisoned and the apple stuck in her throat. Yes. I think I have the solution for that. Clean up all this food. <laughs> okay, let's get off the table, people. <laughs> what are you gonna do, Prince? You're hungry. 
I'm a very strong <laughs> swimmer. Okay, put her on that stool. Okay, let's try this. <laughs> Who are you? I am Prince Heimlich of Sneaker Style. Thank you for saving me. It was really kind. And you're so gorgeous. Well, I just did a little thing I like to call the Heimlich Maneuver. Uh, will you marry me? Yes, but you're a wonderful prince and you saved my life. Yeah! You're happy! Oh, I'm not! Remember to invite us to the wedding! And come back sometime, Snow White, so you can do the dishes for us. We'll be waiting for you and have them ready. Okay! <laughs> that apple. Oh, very good idea. Why didn't I think of that before? <sighs> Magic mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? Bum boo ya ta ta ta. Bum boo ya ta ta. Oh, Queen. Hello. <sighs> you know, it gets very boring in here. I'm glad I have a voice. Oh, uh, I can tell. Your voice is not very good, by the way. <sighs> <sighs> Magic mirror on the wall. Who is the fairest of them all? <sighs> you keep asking me that, Queen. Well, just answer. Here, you are the fairest. Well, what about the world? Well, Snow White has moved away with the prince into another kingdom, and she is the fairest there. Well, at least I'm in the fairest in this kingdom. Oh, well, that's what I have to do. My name is Lorenzo Thomas Vickery, and I played Prince Heimlich, and I played two dwarves. One was um, clumsy, and the other was baldy, and I got this a medal from being awesome. <laughs> and how old are you, Lorenzo? Oh yeah, I'm nine. Hi, I'm Noah James Vickery, and I played the Queen Zade and two dwarves. One was Bob and the other one was dreamy and and I am 857 years old no seven hello my name is Peter I played nosy and whiffy I don't really stink though and I am almost nine My name's Legacy. I played the magic mirror on the wall, and I am 14 tomorrow. Yeah. Bye. My name is Joseph, and I played the huntsman and Holly. <laughs> oh, shorty. And don't know secret. This is a real beard. And I am 11. <laughs> Hi, my name is Liberty Vickery. I am 16 years old. And I played the evil stepmother, the peddler with the corset, the peddler with the comb, and the wicked witch with the apple. Hi everybody, my name is Zion and I play Snow White. And I'm four years old. And bye everybody, I hope you like the show when we're done.